but um, I'm really good at hand-eye coordination, so I'll be naturally gifted at it. You're feeling pretty confident. Yeah. Fucking destroy Agassiz's face. Okay, just add five. Andre Agassi, Agassi, for the first time. Well, if all else fails, my old friend, the Soviet Union. <laughs> Good job, D-Rock. I mean, even those shots are goal were not even close. You did only lose 4-3. I'm impressed with you. It was a good game. It happened. We don't celebrate losing, D-Rock. I know you're on a schedule. No worries. So we're gonna try and get you on there. First no worries. Don't, 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 don't over sweat it. Rock and roll, Christine. Wow. Yeah, this is a pretty exciting day. I can tell you, you know, last week when I reached out to the... Excellent. Keep it away. I wanna win. Yeah, like I actually want to, like I feel like we can. It's a totally different game. Yeah, it's got it's got ping pong esque things to it, which I think can help me. We just need highlights for the vlog. <laughs> we just need an animated gif of you passing Brodick on the baseline. <laughs> now that I realize that I have the chance to be on the same side as Andre and not you, I kind of want to do that. No, you don't. Dumb thing. That's it. Well, why don't you let Andre run pure well with you? <laughs> if I can get people to buy into the strategy but and then watch. To me the perfect storm is understand my religion and then copy everything I do. I start a podcast, you start a podcast. I start doing more filters, you start doing it. Why am I doing less? Hashtags on Instagram. Not for my fucking health. Like, like get my mindset and then do exactly what I'm doing. Yeah. I'm playing pickleball, you go play pickleball. <laughs> <laughs> Such a pleasure. pleasure. Thank you. Real so pleasure. Well. How are you? I'm wonderful. Good. Gary. Wonderful. Come on in. Yeah, Come thanks. Come on in. This is Ryan. How you doing? Ryan, how are you? Uh, Ryan Harwood, nice to meet you. Yeah. How's it going? How are you? Good to see you. Yeah. Nice how are you, man? So, Ryan. Hey. Amir. Amir? Oh, good yeah. So really nice. nice. Yeah. You've never played this? I played it once. Once. Like, but I, I don't know, was that two years ago? Yeah, about Halloween. Two, three years ago. No way. It's been a while. Was it really? Audrey, you've ever played this? No. Ever? Ever. Have you? No. No. I never even heard of this sport until now. It's literally massive. It's exploding. Born ready. Not ready. Not ready. It's time for them in the history of their lives. Not that partner. That's a great shot. Hey! Oh, that's a. Oh, 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 oh. oh, I got this. Hey! Yeah! Gary, stop taking the ball from the cover. Have you ever seen the movie Hit? Yes. Okay, where he tells him to dance and just stay in his lane, like right here. Stay right here. This is you. This is you. This is me. Take your world goes. Hey! Oh! That is the most badass move I've ever seen. That's awesome. Oh, no. Team Agassi. Stay with it, boys. Don't worry about it. 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 Stay with it, boys. Say that was the closest he'd ever been to that right here when it's an illegal shot. No. Yeah. Oh. 
team ride. Thank you, my man. I appreciate Love it, that. Man. Thank you, brother. Love it, bro. Appreciate Good it. Good to see you. Good to see you. you Take care, guys. Night. Stay well. You too. Thank you. I think you and I, as a team, can dominate these things at such a high level. So. Awesome. Thanks Thank a lot. You. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. How are you doing, man? Good, man. How are you? Good, man. How are you? Good. Good. What's up? Thank you, guys. Thank you. Hello. Hi. Hi. Excuse me? Ralph Baker. Your father in law is Ralph Baker. That's so awesome. <laughs> Tell him I said hi. Small businesses in the south. Get ready. We fucking fight. How many years in Chattanooga? Two and a half. Two and a half years in, we fucking unlocked it. Get ready. Offerings are coming. Let's fucking go. The 30 second story is you go to the grocery store to get a loaf of bread. It's been on the shelf 10, 14 days. Hostess is trying to make it 60 days. You don't know what it is. You come to the store <coughs> where this is on the floor. You can have that pot loaf of bread to take home. Can I ask you a question? Say, yeah. Is this available yet? Did you rock? All right. We gotta go. We gotta, go. We gotta run to the front yeah. before we get south by. If you're too structured, you're fucked. Like I've never looked better. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Uh, what's the worst advice you've given? Like, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that was the worst advice. It's a good question. Uh, I can answer it while you're thinking about it. I think the worst I'm advice. Slower. I think saying. the worst. I think the worst advice I give is when I make it through the eyes and ears and filter of who I am as a person. I think too way too many people give advice predicated on themselves. A lot of the things I look for are themes. And, but I spend a lot more time looking at the collective than myself because there's a lot of nuances about me that doesn't map for other people. So I think way too many people's advice is too singular and they, and they don't have empathy to understand the subtleties of everybody else around them. You're welcome. You're welcome. See you guys. Love you. Thank you. Take All right, sir. Bye. Ten years, bro. It's been a legacy play for me. The thought of fucking going bit to do business there just because of fucking capital gains is not fucking smart. Period. These may be a little more extreme. Yeah. Yeah. Else. Yeah. I mean, to me, it's just about value exchange. But it's just reputation. Brother, my name's Stefan. Stefan, real pleasure. Nice to meet you, man. Thank you so, Thank you so much. much. Can I get a quick picture, real quick? You sure can. Moses, no, thank you. Take care, guys. I Stay well. You. Nice meeting you, my man. Hope to see you in New York. All right. All right. Take care of yourself. Congrats yeah, on man. everything. Thank you. Yeah. I'll see you in May. I'll see you in May. Yeah. What's up, guys? No. Hello. How are you? Great. Good to see you. Let me tell you what's going to happen today. We're going to have five companies who are pitching. They're going to give a two minute elevator pitch and then they get six minutes of Q&A with the judges. We're going to have him bring up each company. You guys will go into it. There's a clock right there. I kind of give us a time frame of what's happening. We're the beast right now. Check one two, check one two, level check. Do whatever he says. Never stop. Check one two, check one two. Do it. Um. Is it on? Is your mic on? My mic's on. Do you want my mic? Do you want to borrow it? Get in there. Ashley Kutu, thank you. How are you? All right, here's the deal. Here are the few ground rules. 
We have five amazing, brave entrepreneurs. We're going to come up here for two minutes. My man, you're important. You're important. We need people to look at. We need fucking. You saw what's his name, Peel, say the other day. I mean, I didn't see the Oscars. You know about this, right? He's like, he gave like Whoopi Goldberg a shout. I was like, I was a little boy, and I watched you win an Academy Award, yeah, and I was yeah, like, yeah. and I was like, then I can do. Like that's real. Like, like, like yeah. it's real. Like there's so many kids that struggle in school, and like I need to be out there and be like, look, I'm like, you gotta see people and like, you know. We, it's just important, it's important. If you're a big heavy set black dude in fucking Alabama, 16 right now, and you're fucking smart, it's nice to know it's true. Yeah. And then my big thing is, if, like I'll be honest with you, my big thing is if I do this for you, and I sit down and chop it up and break bread with you, then when Tyrone Thompson from Kansas <laughs> hits you up, I'm hoping that it, subconsciously, not even like, not you being like, oh, Gary did it, just subconsciously you're like, yes. People wait till they, people, they wait till they win, like, I'm gonna wait till I win, and then I'm gonna get back. What I like about you, Gary, is that you've documented this process all the way from my library TV. You can follow the process, and you do what you say you want to freaking do. There's so many people that talk, they don't freaking do nothing. My biggest thing is, it's a, uh, and Phil will tell you this, Phil knows me very well. It's really fun to have Phil and D-Rock here, they know me well for different reasons. Uh, my big thing is, I, I often talk about things I've done more than things I'm gonna do. And when I say I'm gonna do things, one of the things I do poorly is I run my mouth like everybody else, it's just that then I fucking take the L. Like, I, Phil will tell you, I don't think people would understand how many bad deal business things I do. It's because I ran my mouth and it matters more to deliver on what I said than, right? Yeah. My great vulnerability in the micro yeah. is that I, yes. that I say yes too much. Which right? Which is shifted quite a bit. Which is shifted, I've gotten better, right? Oh, that was smart. <laughs> that was fucking awesome. You can email me. You can email me. I fucking love that. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm just like cleaning out. I'm like, yes, 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 yes. yes. Yeah, let's, let's go, let's go. <laughs> but it's in that yes that also makes me different and special. Like, there's people who are gonna beat me, they'll make more money. I'm not built to make the most money. But motherfucker, there's no entrepreneur that's given back to the game like me. And I don't mean like, Here's a million dollars for my name on the fucking school for entrepreneurship. That means dick shit. That means I feel good and I'm cool. Like that, that's fucking ego. I'm giving back with the fucking thing that matters most. My time, my heart, and my fucking head. Yeah.